Hi, my name is Stacy Colbash. I'm a registered dietitian and instructor here at Johnson & Wales University, and this is my colleague. Susan Batten, and I'm a senior instructor here at Johnson & Wales. Today we're going to do a vanilla orange granola. Granola tends to be that you buy in the store it tends to be pretty fatty. So we're going to make it uh, very, very low fat, but with a lot of flavor. And as Stacy's going to address later, how we're going to add super fruits to it to make it even healthier for you. We've got a small saucepan, two tablespoons of oil, some honey, a little bit of vanilla, some cinnamon. I think cinnamon is a great way to add a lot of flavor without adding sugars. Some fresh orange juice, and then the zest of the orange will give it even more flavor. Just want to stir that around till the honey's melted, everything's incorporated. Then I'm going to add the dry ingredients. Oatmeal, got some toasted nuts of your choice, some sesame seeds, or you could use sunflower seeds or pumpkin seeds, and then we have some flax seed meal and some wheat germ as well. Toss that together. You can add a pinch of salt if you want. We're gonna drizzle the wet ingredients over everything. Toss it around. Put it on a rimmed baking sheet. And then put it in the oven. About 15 minutes. Take it out, stir it. And then we're going to add some shredded unsweetened coconut. At that point, you can add dried fruit if you want it, but since it's summertime, we're going to use fresh fruit. OK, here's some of the granola we just pulled out of the oven. We're going to let it cool a little bit. We're going to put it in a serving dish. And then to really add an antioxidant and some healthy phytonutrients, uh, any local berries fresh berries that you can get from the farmer's market or your grocery store. Eight strawberries has more vitamin C than one orange. And what a nice way to sweeten up the granola. Thank you so much. We hope you enjoy. Mm -hmm.